Now, I've actually got to do. I have a pair of pants to do on just in case my trousers fall down any day and I've forgotten to put some on. Because of legal reasons, that's not the subject of today's feature. The fate of the universe will be decided as it should be. Immortal combat. Funnily enough, Stephen Hawkins wrote a book about the very same thing. Having conquered the big screen once already, B-list actors everywhere are strapping on styrofoam chests for the second round of the greatest pan-dimensional punch-up in the world. Break out the bikinis and hockey masks, it's Mortal Kombat Annihilation. Once again, a nasty, rotten, bad bloke Shan Tsung has opened up a gateway to Earth and has dragged our heroes away from a peaceful life of monk-hugging. So, few girls in leather fighting each other, of course. As well as the standard martial arts moves, the actors had to undergo a strict training regime of ballet dancing, playing hide-and-seek, and trampolining. Despite all this, Mortal Kombat Annihilation promises to be a special effects bonanza, with computer graphics and models combining to reproduce the characters we've all come to love so much. We're doing something that's never been done before in special effects. We're having 100% di digitally animated creatures fight in hand-to-hand -hand Mortal Kombat with human beings. Yeah, I'm gonna make you eat that thing. This is a movie that gives you action. This is a movie that gives you drama. This is a movie that gives you comedy. This is a movie that gives you good versus evil. This is a movie that gives you confidence. In spite of having metal arms in the film, if you're called Lin, you're soft. However, punters may well find the cinematic versions of Jade, Sonya, and Katana make them considerably harder. We have a great martial arts happening on this one, very stylized, and um, I think it's going to be more of a ride than the first one. And talking of rides, I still haven't had my date from you, Talisa. Anyway, with the games, the comic, and now two movies under his belt, the Mortal Kombat saga looks set to become the biggest video game franchise ever. The arrival of the Broadway musical is surely just a matter of time, but while you're waiting, Mortal Kombat Annihilation opens nationwide on February the 20th.